What's up guys, Craig here, welcome back to The Walking Dead, and I did actually have to just like replay everything after Kenny woke us up in the barn, but I did everything that I did before, and then I just started from this point, so it's basically the same thing. So, let's go and talk to Herschel in the barn. What's up Herschel? What are you doing? Off How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride. I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. And I walked until your boy found me. Uh -huh. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Oh God. Uh, this farm's <laughs> a nice plot of land. It's changed nah, the subject. If you told me twenty years ago I'd still be doing this. I would have told you that they you were sound, full of crap. By the way, on the game, so never was a plan. It's like having a place like this. Well balanced, I'm it was sure in them. the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. That's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon. My parents are in Macon with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Yep. I was looking for help yeah. in her house. I was looking for help in her house. <laughs> hmm. Maybe shouldn't have said that one. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Exactly. Uh oh, what is this? Go! I'll get my gun. What's happening? Can't show what's happening. Oh. oh god! Oh god! Damn it, duck! Damn it, duck! Oh no! It's all going wrong. Oh, who do I save? Who do I save? Oh, Sean. Sean doesn't deserve this. Watch on, watch on, watch on. This thing! Okay, good. He's got, he, he's got him. Kenny! Help, please! Come on, Kenny. Oh, Kenny, you. Damn it, Kenny. Push, 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 push. 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 Oh, he's not strong enough. Oh, no. Oh, you're joking. No. No. Oh, shit. Oh. Boom. Kill that thing. Damn it. Shit, Sean. I'm okay, Pop. I'm okay. I can fix you. Don't worry. We'll stitch you up. I don't it, think that's gonna work. It almost... It almost got me, man. It, Lee tried to save me. Yeah, I did. I know, son. I... And unfortunately... Oh, no. I failed. I, someone tells me I don't think there was anything I could actually do to help there, because... I tried to save him and he, he just died. Oh damn. No thanks to Kenny. Get out. Uh oh. No, she was angry. Get the fuck out of here! Uh. I'm sorry. Sorry! Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry! <laughs> oh, you no. tried to help him, but this piece of shit let him die. Oh dear. It's nobody's fault. You can't blame Kenny. The hell I can't. You watch your back. We can kill us your daughter and you need his help. Please. Uh, just go. Get out and never come back. <laughs> You've 
got that ride to make it if you want it. Yay. By the way guys, the video quality should now be in 720p. I could be wrong, but I think it is. I think. Oh, it looks like we're in Macon. I, th I, th I think I think it's in Macon anyway. I don't know where. I, I don't know if it is. Well, well I guess. This is as far as we're going. Oh damn. Then it's far enough. Douglas Office Supplies. Who wants Office Supplies? Seriously. Ugh. Drug. Yeah, let's go to the drugstore. Everyone likes drugs. <laughs> Joking. Damn, this is nasty. Hey there! You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Uh, no. They're not friendly. And he's not friendly either. Hey, no. No one's friendly. Oh, dear God. Uh, uh. Holy hell. Oh, where does she come from? Where does everyone come from? Good shot. Yeah, lots of doors. Just in time. Just in time. God, that was close. We can't that was take damn this close. Like this. And we can't just let people die either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. Oh, we God. don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. As if we're dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? They would have died out there. <laughs> Kids with us. I see one little girl. What is it? I, I have to pee. <laughs> I'd go out there again. The game's going really slowly right now, work. by the way. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. I don't give a flying fuck. We're in a war zone. She's not wrong. They took a risk. Yes, we did. And we appreciate it. Now let's settle down. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny! Kenny! What do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It's... Lily, I'll handle this. But your heart, Dad. You need to calm down. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Everyone chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here. And none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. Dad, you get it. It's a big deal. What if this was your daughter? Never would have happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Fuck you and her. <laughs> I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. <laughs> and if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Oh. Then, when she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. She'll turn fast. And then, there'll be three. It's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. 
It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing them out now! No! You don't touch that boy! You don't touch anybody! <coughs> I've got a little girl I'm trying to protect in here, too. You wanna get violent, you old fuck? Well, come <laughs> on! You better have a plan to kill me, though, because it's me before anyone else in here! <coughs> You okay? Just great, thanks. That was intense. Uh, guys? Oh, uh, no. Everybody down! Stay quiet! They're gonna get in! Shut up! Is that the military? We almost died because of this bitch and Richie Trigger Finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Ah! Ah! Oh, God. I must have a heart condition. What's wrong with it? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. It's probably another entrance, maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We <laughs> need nitroglycerin <laughs> pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You're insane. Well, it's got to get done. Plus, I'm quick, and I know make it. <coughs> Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. Lily These boys Larry. will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. She doesn't like not being the lady, does she? I'm back, guys. I'm sorry about that. Uh, I didn't have much chance to comment on what was just going on there because people are around and it's always awkward. But anyway, yeah, uh, that sequence, it was mental. God, that guy, what was his name, Larry, does seem like a bit of a douche, to be honest with you. I mean, he was just so quick to jump to conclusions. He wanted to kill Duck, which was... Pretty harsh, despite the fact that Duck might well be the reason for Sean's death. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, especially considering he's got a heart condition, I mean, get far too angry with him, angry with people. He just seemed to be shouting at everyone around him, apart from his daughter, of course. Can't re can't remember her name. Might be might be Lily or something. And of course, she was he was shouting at Carly as well, the other the other girl. Pretty much shouting at everyone. Right, as I was saying once again, uh, so yeah, the guy does seem like a bit of a prick to be honest. So, overall, I quite like Carly. She, she seems nice. I don't know what to make about the girl or Doug. 
or the other guy who went off for gas. I don't even know what what his name is. And it's pretty much it, really, isn't it? Uh, oh yeah, but I, I don't like Larry. Really don't like, do not like Larry. And and that little scene with Clementine, that was scary. I thought she was gonna get it. I thought that would have been terrible. But thankfully, Carly shot him in the face. So we're gonna go in. Game, the game has been running a bit slowly recently. I'm not really sure why. Take energy bar. I suppose we might as well take one. Examine cork board. We're gonna we're gonna examine everything before we talk to people. I think. The IT IT guy. Anything over here? Greeting cards? No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead cards. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, those those could be good. Ah, oh, that must be his family. I think. If his parents we did all this stuff like that, I assume. To Ducky. I know, hon. I don't remember them very well. I bet you don't. We just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. Can't really do anything now, because... You know, there's kind of... An apocalypse going on. It's all melted now. <laughs> you don't see it. see. Another energy bar? Maybe, maybe we can make an energy bar collection. Trying to get some rest, huh? How can I with those things out there? Open office. I won't go in there yet. Talk to Lily. Uh, another energy bar. Yay! Energy bars 101. Another energy bar. <laughs> They're everywhere. So we have four energy bars now, I think. I wonder if they actually come in useful. Food box, anything in here? Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. <laughs> Shame. Could have used that. Is anyone, anyone in, the, in this toilet this time? Also, has Clementine actually had a pee? It's not damaged. And this place didn't get looted. So, we could actually get the money out of the ATM, right? Although that would be pretty ironic. Anyway, we'll start from where we began, which, so really I should just walk the other way, but we'll start from over here. No, we didn't, we'll go around talking to everyone. Let's talk Clementine first, actually. Clem? Actually, is there anything behind the counter anywhere? No, okay. Actually, wait, what was that? Did I just see something else? That's Lily. <laughs> well, hello Clem. Clem, Clem. Hey there. Hi. Any word from Glenn? Nothing. Is oh, his okay? oh, name's Glenn, okay. Yeah, I think so. You're doing a good job. Ah, the other girl's name is Lily. Okay, so I have everyone's name Glenn, Lily, Larry, Doug, and Carly. Okay. Can I uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. Yeah, I'll we have energy that. bars. So, um. Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh, I'm good. That's good. <laughs> yeah. How awkward is this? I think so. Uh, being good is good, <laughs> despite the circumstances. Well, that's better than being eaten. Yep. We'll sit tight. Okay. I guess we'll give her an energy bar, yeah? Everything okay? Mm-hmm. Okay. Keep an energy bar then. Not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. You took care of Clementine. Yay! Clem, Clem. Lily? No, sorry, Carly. Oh, this new paper. Central High Tech State. Paper's a week old. Feels like years. <laughs> not surprised. What the hell kind of eyes is he looking at? Like? <laughs> what? <laughs> Look at those eyes. Oh, okay. Exactly. What are you radio. messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work though. Here, let me have a look. 
can we get it to work? So let's say volume. Power. Nothing. Flip the radio over. Is there actually any batteries in? There isn't, damn it. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? You know that there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. <laughs> I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. Yeah, she seems a little bit dim, but she seems nice anyway, so she, she's good hearted. I think, I think that's probably a good best thing. So we need to look for some batteries. Talk to Carly first. You're though. a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from <laughs> her last cup of coffee. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't tell. I wouldn't say so. My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me. Oh. And I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. Oh, well. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah. That guy saved you? Yeah. Can you believe it? Those creeps, or, or ghouls, or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart, and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You what a hero. You tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kinda cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. <laughs> huh? Huh? Oh, nothing. Oh, she fancies him. <laughs> How'd you end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. <laughs> Sounds worth it. I'm still looking for batteries for that day. Thanks. I appreciate it. Yeah. I better get back to it. Yep. Okay. I guess we're gonna talk to Doug now. Actually, actually first, can we get an energy bar? Here. I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, uh, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't need it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. <laughs> so I have two energy bars left now. Doug? Have heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Hi a minute then. Why was the the you know the doors in front of the store like the, the doors of the store and all the like walls shaking and being battered down if the gate was closed? Sure. Let's go have a look around. I'm not really cool. sure. And what... we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. I guess we'll look around then. Just go outside for a bit. Chill. Jesus. Oh lord, there's, that, there's a lot of zombies. Well, at least, at least the gate is indeed closed. Oh god, there's people. Oh. That's nasty. He just eat. As far as I can tell, that's all they care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. Damn. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, it might be a couple of damn months. I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Let's reach for that brick and throw it at one of the heads. I can't reach that brick. Damn it! <laughs> Is there anything we can look at? Boarded yeah, up with this. Hasty fortification job over there. You don't yeah, say. It didn't work. <laughs> trapped walker. So don't trapped over there. <laughs> Better than uh, us. Huh? Uh, oh shit! Uh oh. What? Do you know that guy? Could be a drugstore employee. So you're saying he might have the pharmacy keys? Oh. I'm saying he might have the pharmacy keys. I think that might be his brother, to be I honest. Could be anybody, you know. They start rotting and get all chewed up and. Shut up, Doug. <laughs> oh, I understand why. I understand why he's. Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. Take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there. That's true. He has the keys. 
Damn, how am I gonna get over this? Somehow prove that he worked here. I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. He could prove it himself, but he needs to find other means, doesn't he? He doesn't want to reveal anything. TV stuff. <laughs> Too bad we don't have a way to come out here and watch the news. Would be nice to know what's going on elsewhere. Atlanta's in rough shape, and that's all I know. Everything's going pretty bad. It's hardware stuff. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. Not a bunch of guys showed up, and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Damn. It's not going well at all, is it? Lock? It's a combination lock. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. <laughs> yeah, it's too risky. We prove that that guy worked here, and then we can try to clear okay. the street to search him for the keys. Probably easier said than done. Look, it says Lee's brother there, so it's clearly his brother. Damn it. It's a shame. They can't reach that brick. Can't reach the brick. Not really much else we can do here than talk to the dog then. We should think about searching that guy across the street. Yeah, you said that three times. Maybe he has them, but who knows if he actually worked here. Look at the damn uniform, you fool. How'd you end up here? I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff and it just made sense. <laughs> so you're local. You probably knew the owner. Sounds a bit place. geeky. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time. On the computer? No, just doing my own thing. <laughs> what about you? I grew up in. I grew up here. Been trying to get home since the day I came back. Oh, so you probably knew the owners then? Yeah, I did. Good people. They're probably his parents. Ugh. Damn, that's a shame. Anything else? Yeah, we'll go back inside, I think. Not Let's much else to do. Inside. Okay. Bye, zombies. Be back in a bit. Right, so we should go keep going this way. Greeting cards. Battery. Battery. Yay. So we've got one battery, we need another one. God knows where it will be. It's not there anyway. It's not one of these. Nope. It's not anywhere over there. Talk to these guys, I suppose. Hey Lee. Really gave that old man hell. <laughs> we got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. Anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. How's Duck How's doing? How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell tell. nobody got nabbed on the way He's in here. He's not hyperactive anymore. Kid. How's she doing? She's good, I think. She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What are you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. Mm, true. She's a What's tough one. Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Uh, Jesus, the riser is what the wise looking seen. for them? They own this place. They, uh, own this place. They're gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they're dead. Oh, damn. Are shit. you guys all right? We're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. Yeah, he's, he's, Lee, he's in shock. You got a second? Sure. What were they talking about? Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. I panicked, you know. I'm not proud of it. It happens. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. Yeah, that's rough. I killed that boy. We could have saved him together. You didn't have yep, any choice. Yeah, true. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, 
when things are really out of control. True. It's you, you, you just panic, really, don't you? I guess. Well. <sighs> Trying to let it go. 